Hey, this will be a video chart on ticker symbol NTEK. We will take a look at the daily time frame. It has certainly been a while since the last time I did this one. I uh, can't remember when the last time I did it. I think late July, but uh, nonetheless, want to get things updated here. Had a bunch of requests come in on it today, but I can see why. Uh, biggest volume it's had in a while, and then that's combined with a nice green candle. So, uh, you know, always good to see increasing volume and then correlating increasing price action. Nothing worse than seeing a volume increase and then seeing the price either go sideways or down. Wasn't the case here, though, obviously. Volume went up, price went up, perfect combination. So what I want to do is just update some things here from the charting perspective. Uh, these lines you see here were from the last time I did it. So again, if you go back and look through the archives, you can see uh, exactly when that was and why I drew the resistance lines where I did. But I'm going to talk about them uh, more so this one down here. Um, but nonetheless, if you want to go back, uh, feel free to do so. Let's first though talk about some levels of support. And the big level of support that is now a support, meaning uh, this purple line here was a, a very important level of support and then when the price fell below it here it became a level of resistance so uh, seeing that the price was able to get back up above the 50 day cent moving average uh, and that's valued at 0 0.063 is a good sign so ideally now going forward the level that you want to see the price continue to close above is 0 0.063 or the uh, value of the 50 day cent moving average because since this is a moving average it will be changing value uh, every day but right now its current value is 0 0.063 now a static level, meaning it does not change with time of support that you're going to want to see hold if the 50 day doesn't hold. So, uh, you know, maybe this level down here won't even get tested, but in the event it does, this is another important level. I'm going to make that uh, thicker since it is an important level and we'll call, we'll call this uh, 0.056. So 0.056 is another very important level because as you see, if this level does not hold, then the next level of support let's just bring this down real quick the next level of support is not until this level down here which you can see has now provided support whoops on multiple occasions uh, the low from back here on July 19th which was 0 0.046 and then you can see the low here from uh, August 14th was 0 0.045 so pretty darn close and a good example of how charting uh, some charters I'm sure uh, we're down here accumulating on this uh, pullback right at this support and then you know made some nice little profits. So in terms of resistances, uh, this level still remains the key. I'm not sure when I drew this line, but whenever I did, it's still holding true. Uh, this is at 0 0.0795. So 0 0.0795 is definitely still that key level of support, uh, maybe on a little shorter term scale. You could call this level right around here at 0.07, another area of uh, resistance, and today's high was at 0.069. Uh, you can see quite a bit of price history around here. Uh, but however you want to look at it, 0.07, but uh, any way you slice it, 0 0.0795, 0.08 is definitely the, the key level of resistance because that that's kind of would launch it into this uh, open territory up here. But one step at a time, uh, good day today. So now it's just a matter of seeing if there can be any follow through here the rest of this week. If there are any other questions on the chart, please let me know. If not, I'd encourage you to sign up for a free newsletter up there. When you do that, you'll be sent a free ebook. And if you enjoyed the video and want to learn more about charting and how to use it in your strategy as a trader, I'd encourage you to click below and look at our video course. Over eight and a half hours of education and teaching. It's been getting great third party reviews and testimonials. So I'd encourage you to make an investment into yourself as a trader and check it out. One more time, this was NTEK. Thanks for listening.